is Jeanette Kozlowski with TacticalGear.com. I'm here at SHOT Show 2014 at the TruSpec booth, and I'm joined by Jeff Mason. Jeff, what do you have for us today? Well, I'm really excited to talk about this because it's one of these products that we don't really talk about that much, and that's the Gen 1 Police BDU and the Gen 2 Police BDU. Uh, BDU is an acronym that, that refers to a battle dress uniform, and for many years that was... Uh, what law enforcement adopted is their Class C trouser, their training trouser. You know, what the Army wore, you know, they would uh, it just incorporate it and put it in solid colors. But it still had a button fly, and a lot of the police and uh, sheriff's uh, personnel just really didn't like fumbling around with the button fly. Button fly is great for in theater situations because it has noise discipline built into it. So what we did on the Gen 1 BDU is we just simply put a zipper in it. And it was a huge success. The law enforcement um, community really embraced it because they wanted it. So we did it in three colors. And then the Gen 2, which we put in two colors in solids, um, in black and dark navy, we decided to incorporate the flex fit waistband like we have in the 24-7 tactical band and to put in uh, a gripper bead in there to catch the shirt so that shirts wouldn't become untucked, which is also a minor problem in law enforcement, but it's a, it's a problem. So uh, these two items have done very well with the police community who still want the BDU look because the BDU's got a, a certain look to it. It's more traditional in some of their minds, and yet it's got the zipper or the flex fit waistband or the gripper here. And what fabric did you choose for this pants? Uh, we still use a 65 poly, 35 cotton ripstop. So the weave is still the same. The fabric content is still the same as like what we have in the tactical pant, but it's a little bit heavier. Uh, poly cotton rip and we use a vat dye and vat dye just gives those solid colors more saturated color integrity for a longer period of time. All right. And how many pockets does the pant have? You know it's a traditional BDU uh, pocket uh, or pant so basically you have just your front slash pocket, your back pocket and then your uh, side cargo pockets that are traditionally a three pleat uh, cargo pocket look. So when you really stack the pan up, it's a six-pocket pan. All right. Jeff, thank you so much. And this has been Jeanette Kozlowski with TacticalGear.com.